Hey everyone, so today I am doing a makeup tutorial based off of Nicki Minaj's new music video, Super Bass, and if you know me, you know that I love Nicki Minaj. This is the first look that she had in the video, and it pretty much just consists of bright yellow eyeshadow, some super long dramatic lashes, a little bit of pink eyeshadow on the lower lash line, bronze skin, and a bubblegum pink lip. So if you'd like to see how to do this look, then just keep on watching. Alright, so the first thing that you want to do is prime your eyelids. I'm going to use Urban Decay's Primer Potion, and I'm also going to apply a little bit to my lower lash line just because some color will be applied there. So I'm just going to go ahead and blend this out. So in Nikki's look, she had a bright yellow eyeshadow on her lid. So I'm going to go ahead and take Chrome Yellow by MAC. And this is a matte yellow. And you want something matte or just with a little bit of a sheen to it. So I'm going to go ahead and apply that using a 239 flat stiff brush. You want to pack that on the brush and then tap off the excess just because this color does have a little bit of fallout. And then I'm going to take a Kleenex and I'm just going to place this right under my eye like this just so if there is any fallout, it's not going to fall out onto my face. So if you are doing this look, I recommend doing the eyes first and then your foundation, but I did it the opposite way for the sake of this video, so I'm gonna do it this way. So you wanna put that under your eye and then just start patting this color on, and by patting, you're going to get less fallout. So I'm just going to pat that all over my eye. going to create the shape that we want. So you want to follow the natural shape of your eye, go right above the crease and just create an oval shape. So just like this. And make sure you've taken it right into the very inner corner, just like that. So now that you've created that shape, I'm going to take a small angle brush. This is the E65 by Sigma. It's just an angled brush. And I'm going to go into a light pink color. This is De Bling by MAC. So you just want to pack that on the brush. And we're just going to line our lower lash line with this. And this color is actually very similar to what Nikki had. So De Bling is a great option. Now to make our eyelashes look thicker and more full, I'm going to take my Bobbi Brown Longwear Gel Eyeliner in black ink and I'm going to take a pencil liner and just dip it in there. So just like this. And I'm going to line my tight line. What I like to line my tight line is by taking my lashes and just pushing them back. That way I'm not pulling and creating premature wrinkles. So just pull your eyelashes back and line this tight line here. Now to prep for the false eyelashes, I'm going to take my Rapid Black Penultimate Liner by MAC and this is just a felt tip liner like that and I love using this because it's very easy to apply. So I'm going to go ahead and line my upper lash line. Now for the fun part, which is our lashes, I'm going to take my non peril 09 lashes and they look like this. They're very long and full and I really like them and these are very easy to apply just because the band on them is very thin. So I'm going to have a link below where you can check these out if you're interested. So I'm going to take this and apply these using my Duo Eyelash Adhesive and then I'll be right back. Now that these lashes are applied, I'm going to take a little bit of mascara and work that at the base of these lashes just so it can help blend my natural lashes in. So just like that. And oh my gosh, I totally forgot to mention this, but you want to take a blending brush. This is my 224 and just run this right along the edges of that yellow eyeshadow just so there's no harsh line. And yeah, so now that's all for the eyes. So Nikki didn't really have a lot on her cheeks. She just had a little bit of bronzer on. So I'm going to take my NARS Laguna bronzer on a 109 brush. Just get a little bit of that and I already have a little bit on but you want to start at the apples of your cheeks and blend it back towards the temples so just like that 
Nikki also had some hot pink dots on her face that I think were supposed to be like hot pink freckles, but I'm going to skip that step and I'm just going to move straight on to the lips. So Nikki had bright bubblegum pink lips and I'm thinking she used her own lipstick that was exclusive at MAC for a little while, but since I don't have that one, I'm going to take Viva Glam Gaga, which is quite similar to it. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply this. So this is the completed look. I really like it. I think it's very bold and fun. So I hope that you like it as well. Remember to follow me on Twitter and like my Facebook page and leave your thoughts in the comments below and let me know what other celebrity inspired looks or just any other makeup tutorials that you would like to see. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye.